Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode, another episode of Matt's Minecraft World Tour. Um, it's been a while since I've filmed, really, nearly a week. Actually, it's a week exactly. I've done a lot of work for here at the Stronghold, and I'm just going to pop down and show you. This episode's going to be split down into several different topics. So here we are. Oh, what's my here again? Cooking. I've been doing a lot of mining in this area. Got a lot of got some redstone or lapis. Maybe a whole stack of iron blocks. Rails. That, that. All the stuff I've got from dungeons in this area. Three and a bit of stone. Loads of stuff from the strong people. Chest of stone bricks. Half chest of moss and stone. Half chest of cracked. Half chest of stone bricks again. Always another half of mossy and a couple more stuff. More cracked and stuff because they're stacked with crack. As you see, I've been getting rid of all the silver blocks I've left out here. Um, I kind of I've done all the area down there, and then the next thing I've done is over here. I'm just working backwards now, by along my way my way along this corridor. Um, I haven't actually worked on this in a while though. I've been doing a little mining around the zero zero base, just lighting up caves and such. So, um, but yeah, I have done quite a bit here. Loads of stuff here. God, oh, we could probably double out those resources by the end. So this is ready to go. Um, actually, while we're here, let's just make a walkway up to it very quickly. We'll do that later on in this episode. After we've updated to 1.4, I'm still on 1.3 at the moment. So I'm back here at zero zero now, or the home base, or the center of the, the world hub, whatever you want to call it. And I've got these signs set up. This is kind of like my aims for 1.4, starting off like the main new features I want to do. Starting in the center, battle the wither, obviously. That's the main thing in the snapshot, really. That's my ultimate goal. I might do everything else before it, or not, but yeah. Start this end, make pumpkin pies, it's pretty simple. Form the stairs and towers, I mentioned in a previous episode, I believe. Bit of corner stairs, kind of like there or in there, and there, just to kind of smooth it out because we've all got the smooth thing going on with the bottom bit. Um, so I'd like to carry that on, just make it a little bit more aesthetically pleasing. Dye leather armor just for fun, create item frames, create flower pots, create cobble walls just because I need to use, I need to use them at some point. Find a bat, just very simple, probably find one. Check the dome is fireproof now. I actually have uh, you know the, the lava in the ceiling at the bottom in the nether area. Originally that did catch fire of some of the wood, not necessarily here but downstairs, but I just want to make sure that it doesn't then catch fire again when the fire aspects are, you know, pumped up. Pipe protecting carrot farms, which obviously links to finding a carrot and potato. Collect the wither skeleton heads in the nether, evidently. Go to the minecart link to transport villagers from village alpha to here. I know there's a different nether portal here for that, I don't know how exactly, but we'll have to see. Find a 
of witch hut. Very nice. Um, what's that in the swamp over there? Sorry. Create a beacon, which obviously links on Battle of the Wither. Because can't create a beacon until I'm Battle of the Wither. I don't know where I put it really here, because if I put it there, it, the effects would kind of like ease off around here, because it's only 40 by 40. Like the, um, it was like the highest one, so I don't know where I'll put it. Or I might just put like, if I get several never stars, I might put several like speed ones just around. I don't know. Uh, create an anvil as well. Test that new sound, because there's loads of new sounds, so that'll be fun to test that. Find a cassette parrot, test out the maps, I'm going to do loads for zero, 00 around here. Be quite fun to do. Ride a pig, over the road. Breed pigs and chickens with the carrots and the seeds. Find mobs with armor, just as an extra thing. Set up chests for projects now, um, like for the beacon. For a full size beacon, it takes a couple stacks of iron. Now, I don't really want to just like, dive in and grab my iron blocks already, like I already have, because eventually, if I do all my projects, I'll lose all my iron and I'll only get, get a bit left. So, project chests will have a chest for each project, main project, and then before I start it, I'll collect everything I need for the project and put it in there. Just so I don't run my resources dry. Brew new potions, the potion of invisibility and night vision. Test out new trap doors, just because you can place them on the top bit of the block now, so I've learned a bit better. Find a zombie villager, just an extra thing. Get a wolf and dye her collar. I'm going to get another wolf as my little buddy now. Uh, her, yeah, it's not sexist, it's just. I'll probably call her she, I'll put her a she. Set up wither skeleton spawning ground and a wither arena. So never that's a spawning ground and never fortress but it's just surrounded by lava. With a large open space where you can get loads of wither skeletons from. So you can get loads of heads, so you can get loads of withers, so you can get loads of beacons, etc. And a wither arena where I'm gonna fight the wither. So it just might be just, you know, an area. Not here obviously. Um, in one of the snapshots I'm gonna actually battle it here, not in creative action. Right, so this is part two then. I'll uh, update to 1.4. Uh, I'll do that over at the stronghold. And I'll get ready to go and fight the Ender Dragon. Alright then, we're ready. Got a nice sword here, sharpness 4, fire aspect 2. Obviously, the fire doesn't do anything, but yeah. Uh, two bows, power 4, punch 2. Uh, I don't know, I've got two. They're exactly the same because punch and flame don't work, but yeah. Uh, diamond chest plate. Iron helmet, iron leggings, diamond boots. Just because I didn't really want to spend loads of time. I already I had the diamond chest plate and boots already. I didn't want to spend ages just AFKing. A mob spawner for iron leggings and stuff. Uh, just three potions, not much. And the chest, which has got some stuff in it for after we kill him. And six stacks of arrows because we're gonna need them. Um, uh, yeah. Let's put them in. Was that? I was gonna say something, wasn't I? Oh yeah, we're in Minecraft 1.4 now, so yeah, we're actually in it. There we are. Stay plunge. The rain's just outside, so yeah. 360. Okay, we're here. I've been training for this just because I'm going for a slightly different strategy than you, most people do. Um, so we're not gonna we're gonna ignore it for a bit. Um, the main strategy here is I'm going to get rid of all the- Oh, sh- <laughs> Um, yeah, I'm going to shoot the end of crystals, as most people do. There we are. And then... Let's just load all this now. Takes each to load this place. Get rid of the end because like everyone apart from maybe, maybe one or two, depending on what the ones over by the um, yeah, I might have to load it in for it to work first. You just see them stuck on in midair because the obsidian hasn't loaded. I don't know why it's taking ages to load. Sneakers have updated. So. There we are. Oh, yeah, dude. See how much health we got on already. 
Those rank fights are pretty easy as usual. If you do the normal strategy everyone does. Which is get the crystals and kill it. Done. Uh, but I'm doing a slightly different one. Where I get some of the crystals. I want. My, I think I'm thinking about integrating some kind of like just kind of like monument to the end of crystal. <laughs> I don't know, like highlight it in the center of my end base. Oh, okay. Obviously, as most people do, because um, it means if you accidentally fall in or something, you can get out quickly. That's where it is. I probably won't really use these two because they're too high up. Too high up to do like straight from the, uh, the portal. Keep that one there. Put it in. Keep that one as well. away from that and so we're near the entrance portal which is there. Where are you going? Okay so I'm gonna fight and we'll have to do a bit of montage or just clipping for here. Because this could take a while. Oh dear. So won't be building this base out of cobblestone actually. Actually won't be building it out of cobblestone, it's just for a dragon egg. Right, um Yay. Okay. So I think it's interesting. Okay. 
So I'm gonna get back to spore. I'll get back to zero as well. I'll jump in here and I will see you in a minute. Bazinga! And we're back. Just spawned in. I watched the whole credits, it takes ages. <laughs> um let's just grab what should we make? Not a sword. I'll make another pickaxe, I suppose. Uh, I make far too many pickaxes. I'll show you in a second. Yeah, that's pretty good. Uh, I'll just show you guys. Here's the spawner. Here's the bottom of the tunnel thing. They drop in over there. And over here oops, is the edge of the slime farm. Got up, and this is just this is hilarious. Look, there's so many slimes in here. It's just like a slime helicopter. We'll get too close because the sound will overpower me, but what? How many are there in there? 77 ish? No. Right, so let's go onto this board and we'll see what we can get on with. We can do, let me see, cobble stairs and towers, I'll do that in a second. Cobble walls, yeah, I'll do create, just creative stuff. And then we'll take that off, and maybe we'll get carrot and potato and stuff in there. So, I'll do some stuff, and I'll bring you back. Alright, so I've done some of the stuff. Um, go all here, start up here, make pumpkin pies, go on here. Om nom nom nom, can't eat it at the moment, yeah. Corner stairs and towers, I have done that. You can see the lighting glitch still, that, that doesn't really bother me that much. It'll get fixed in 1.5, hopefully. So, but yeah, they look a lot better now on all three of them. Uh, just gotta add one more tower now. <laughs> oh, I've still got all the scaffolding over there. I'll take that down. Die lever arm, I just about to do that now. That one with lime, just because I had lime lying around, and I think it looks pretty cool. Just die it, just for all the head of it. Not really, I'm gonna use it. I think it looks pretty cool. Uh, what else we got? Item frames. I got. Si I'm just going to sadly make 64 of them just because. You know, I'm going to need loads for storage room design whenever. So. Uh, what else we got? Flower pots. I only got one because. You know, I haven't got anything to put in it either, have I? Nope. Uh, I only created one because I only had three clay bricks lying around. Um, got walls. Some of each here. Da. What's next? I find a bat. I haven't done that on a lot. I found. I've seen. I don't know. Have I seen some? I think I've seen some, yeah. Check down with fireproof, so it hasn't burned down, so yeah, hopefully. Check carrot farms, obviously not yet. None of those, none of those. Testing out new sounds, done that. Find a carrot and potato. Got them from some zombies. And I just use the bread maker over there, because it works with these as well. Just to um, do that. Test that maps is what I'm going to do next. Breed pig and chickens, no. Ride a pig, no. No. Well, I found some, yeah. Not on camera, though. Test new trapdoors, no. No, no, no. New, new. I don't know any of that yet. Let's just take off what we have done. Uh, none of that. Okay, let's go test out these maps. Let's get some paper. Which I don't actually have that much of at the moment, do I? Damn it. Paper and compass, isn't it? Yeah. Do I have no oh, six compasses up here. Paper. I've only got that much. Because I always sell it as soon as I get it. Make a map. Empty map, obviously. And then we're going to go to zero zero just to make sure it's in the right chunk. And it should be centered around the dome, so wish us luck. <laughs> oh, I've set its mob spawner back on again. It's working all right. Not great, but you know, it's because it's got a slime farm on too. And yep, it's worked. We're right at the center of that. That looks really cool. Map number five. I think I should be able to eight, name them in the animals though, so that's going to be pretty good. Uh, and then let's get make another one. Yeah, actually, there's no point in making another one because I won't be able to clone it because I need more paper for that again, don't I? Actually, no, wait, I can clone it. So you need expanding it, is what I meant. I can't do anything 
Let's see. Okay. Do stack of this. Arrow, shall we? I believe it's like this now. Oh yeah. Nice sound for it. Uh, let's see if we can do. We don't. We have to walk. No. Yeah, we can. Meh. So it'd be like zero, zero. Oops. <coughs> I would call it what world hub small like that and I do that. But I'm not going to at the moment. Just because I not decided quite yet on what I want to do. But yeah we got an anvil now so that's another thing kicked off. I'm going to get that now. And I think that's where I'm gonna end this video today is since I've done quite a bit. I've been killing the Ender Dragon. I'm gonna get up to a load between these two uh, between this episode and the next one, including get starting up the project chest. Let me do that now, actually. Let me get a double chest for it, actually. Uh, we're going to get a project chest for the Enderman farm, because that's the main reason we went to the n end in the first place, to start an Enderman farm for Enderpearls. So we can use them for and they're filling in cracks around here, etc. Because otherwise it'd be really quite hard. Um, and then also on the treehouse as well. Let's get rid of this now. We've got loads of signs now. Where are they going? There. I just feel like doing this. Laser pistons, trip wire, string and stuff. So I'm gonna need to make a spider spawner as well. So yeah, uh, thank you for watching this video, guys. I hope you enjoy 1.4 when you get it. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video as well. Obviously, uh, all the details for contact are in the description. Thank you for watching. Have a good day. See you next time.